Girls are ready. Let's go. Yeah, man. Let's go. Hello, outlaws. Hello, campers. It's Jack. Welcome back to uh, episode two of Dog Camped. Uh, there's a somewhat less than faithful companion, Sarsaparilla Gorilla. Lacey, for some god unknown reason, is sitting up here. Come on, Lace. Laces, let's go. We're going back to, uh, yep, <laughs> I submit. You guys probably haven't seen this in a while. Okay, good girl, good girl. Yeah, you're a good girl. Okay, roll over. Come on, let's go. See, yeah, this is a problem with having those invisible fences because uh, they know their boundaries and they won't go past them unless you bring them past them. Grillis, let's go. Come on. We're going camping. That's right, guys. We're going camping. Or girls, whoever. Maybe there's some guys out here watching this. I don't know. Um, but yeah, guys, welcome back to uh, Outlaw Camp. It's going to put the uh, ghetto gate up here uh, as you can see I've done absolutely nothing to prepare for this uh, next episode um, but I'm glad you guys are all back uh, I want to apologize for that last one man I know it was here and there and all over the place um, hopefully this one will be a little more coherent um, but if you guys believe that then you're in the wrong place um, and if for whatever reason you're new here and you feel like you might be in the right place hit that subscribe button right now because i'll tell you guys man it don't cost nothing it'll help me out it'll help you out i mean i said this before a long time ago you know maybe you're having a bad day you know don't take it out on you know whoever you know person at the store the guy at the laundromat the guy in the deli you know I'm not gonna spit on your food and I'm not gonna piss in your uh, clothes dryer if you unsubscribe me. Um, so, you know, look, man, everybody wins. I'll tell you, I had a couple beers um, and I'm gonna have another one. I'm gonna get this fire going. I am gonna get the uh, whole cooking system set up here. As you can see, I got stuff out here ready. We're gonna, uh, you know, mess around with some uh, new gear and stuff and uh we're gonna cook some frog legs so thanks for all coming back guys get yourselves a drink or whatever the uh, intoxicant of your choice is because trust me you guys are gonna need it for this one this is dog camped those are the dogs and i'm your host jack If you guys think I know what I'm doing, you're definitely in the wrong place. Probably gonna be it. 
for the uh, grill situation. Now, uh, the bugs, there's no bugs, man. I saw one mosquito. Um, I got a thermosel right here. Um, this is a uh, new backpacker thermosel or something. I don't know what style of thermosel it is. I used this uh, over the summer uh, when there were no bugs. At least no bugs that bothered me. Um, but I have it back here just in case. Although with this nightmare, world's worst fan you know they say that uh 90 percent of uh getting a fire going is your fire lay or whatever preparation i don't know uh they also say that you should know how to use a uh you know, ferro rod, uh, bow drill, all that kind of stuff. Um, I got me a cigarette lighter. This probably don't look like much right now, but uh, this is where I'm gonna be cooking some uh, hopefully delicious frog legs. I gotta clean up a little bit of this mess. We're gonna scoop some of that, uh, this goop out of there. Uh, I got some charcoal, it's up there. Um, I'm gonna have to get the charcoal and uh you know once i get a fire established i'm just gonna throw the charcoal right on top of that and that's what we're gonna be doing our cooking um i also have uh to complement the frog legs some uh, teriyaki noodles it's um you know one of those like nor or something you know noodle pouches you guys know what i'm talking about if you don't you'll see it shortly uh that i'm just gonna boil the water using a uh, stove that i had in uh it's in that little orange box there. I had that in uh, some of my previous uh, Adirondack camping videos. Uh, I'm just gonna use that because, yo man, this is Outlaw Camp. We're camping in our backyard. You know, suspend your belief in reality. You guys wanna see bushcraft stuff. Um, you wanna see professional campers. You're already on YouTube, man. You're in the right place. You wanna see somebody just hanging out with their dogs, having a good time getting dog camped. You're in the right place. This is a place, man. Look at this. Lacey's out here. Potato laces. Say hello to all the uh, all my subscribers, fans, new people here. There's Grillis, Sasparilla. Tent's still up. Fridge is still over there. Um, yeah, everything's pretty much where I left it from the last episode. I really gotta get. You know, I got the grill grate right there. I don't see. You know. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Uh, this thing, I think the last time I used this was uh, Louis Lake, Indian Lake, maybe. You guys probably all saw that. Uh, the uh, bacon fire. Uh, I'm just gonna set it up there to heat it up, get some stuff burned off of it. I'm probably gonna regret that later. Um, oh wait, I have gloves. We'll be all right. So yeah, let me get the grill on here, get this cleaned out, get a fire going in there, and um, let me get some wood onto this. And uh, yeah, let's cook some frog legs, guys. Actually, what am I doing, man? This is an outlaw camper video. Um, and it's a new outlaw camper video. It's been a little while since I've seen everybody. Let's have a drink. Beer in there. Um, what are you girls so excited about? I'm not cooking anything yet. Oh, man, alive. These girls. Man, I don't care. Uh, it's great to be out here outside camping with my two dogs. Um, the girlfriend is still out with her friend somewhere. I have no idea where. I think they went to like a food truck festival or something like that. I got no clue. It don't matter. Um, I still have another uh, Perfect Day uh, Pilsner in there, um, which you guys saw in last episode. And I still have that IPA. 
but I'm thinking about saving that IPA for a nightcap. And uh, speaking of night, uh, right now it is five minutes until five. So I've got about an hour and 45 minutes of daylight left. Uh, the sun is gonna be setting about 6.40. Uh, I got a feeling it's going to be dark back here before then, and um, I don't really have any artificial light right now, but I will. I really want to get cooking before it gets too dark, um, but you know, you guys know how that goes. It's, I'm usually back here you know, with a headlamp trying to cook a fucking hot dog or something, but all right, guys, um, you know, the more I talk and the less I drink, the longer it's going to take. So let's get to this, guys. It's another moose head. Tell you, man, I love this stuff. I don't know what the deal is. Uh, it's kind of weird, man. I don't think I can actually get this at the beer store that I normally go to. Um, well, I don't really normally go to it. I don't go anywhere except for work and you know the gas station to get cigarettes <laughs> and uh, then come home um, and then go to sleep. Uh, speaking of which. Like I said, guys, I'm pretty tired. Uh, I mean, I said this in the last video, I've been up since like three this morning. Uh, yeah, I went to work at like four. Luckily I got out early. That's why I'm back here uh, getting dog camped. But hey man, let's have a drink. Um, what do you want, Grillis? You wanna get down? Yeah? All right, see, she jumps up in the chair and then she just, you know, she for some reason can't get down. Wanna have a bear, bear with me? No, oh, you happy girl, huh? Yeah, man. Could you imagine if I actually was able to take these girls camping? Like in a real place. It may happen someday. Uh, today's not the day, though. We're just going to camp back here in our backyard. Okay, Grillis, that's enough. Good girl, go play. Brother's having a beer. All right, so before I totally lose daylight, uh, first of the video, uh, I don't know, whatever you want to call it, man. Have a drink with me. Might be a little shaken up. But at least it's not piss warm and flat. You guys know what I say about that. So, uh, here's the old guy in the woods. Yeah. I don't know if uh, he can get moose head where he's at. Um, it's in Indiana. Um, you know, but. Don't take my word for it. Don't listen to me. Um, if you guys have not been watching Old Guy in the Woods, you need to check him out. There's going to be a link down in the description. Old Guy in the Woods. Seriously. Um, I know you guys have heard of him. I got to get me a cigarette here. Um, I know you guys have heard of him because he actually won, I think it was my 850 subscriber giveaway. I'm not sure. Whatever my last giveaway was, he won it. And I don't think I knew at the time that he had his own channel. And um, I started watching his stuff. It's great, man. This guy, like, he kayaks all over the fucking place. He's camping all over the place. Um, and the places he goes are just they're beautiful. It's amazing. Um, all summer, man, this guy was doing stuff. He's probably going to be doing stuff all fall. I wouldn't be surprised if he's doing stuff in the winter. Like I said, he's in Indiana. But seriously, check him out. And when you do check out Old Guy in the Woods, subscribe to him. Seriously. You won't regret it. And, uh, you know, when you do subscribe to him, you watch some of his videos or whatever, make sure you tell him Outlaw Camper sent you. And uh, make sure you say hi to Uncle Rich. So yeah, guys, it's um, six o'clock, and it's uh, sixty-six degrees out here. So take that for what you will. Um, I haven't really done a lot. I've just kind of been hanging out you know um i've been watching some youtube videos i ain't gonna lie you know I'm supposed to be camping but there's something about getting drunk with all your youtube heroes uh watched some small plots with kevin um cut up on uh you know old guy in the woods watched some expeditionary johnny 
Um, Indian Hemlock. Checked out some stuff from him I haven't seen in a while. Uh, those are all good guys, man. You probably already know about them. Uh, but yeah, guys, it's, uh, you know, I'm burning daylight here, as usual. Uh, my cooking fire here is, you know, it is what it is. I just kind of want the flames to die down and the charcoal to ash over. Oh, Lacey is still out here. She just hacked up something. God knows what she just ate, but she's hanging out in the chair. Sassy's here. I think she's waiting for the girlfriend to come home. I got no clue where she is. Uh, she's out doing whatever it is that girlfriends do. Um, I'm sure she's having a good time. I got my hurricane lantern out here. Um, this thing has definitely seen better days since I got it, but we're gonna fire that up later, see how it works. Uh, you guys seen the Tiki torch. Uh, I got another one here, man. I went to, uh, I think it was uh, Home Despot. Uh, definitely wasn't Lowe's because that's out of my, uh, you know, traveling uh, triangle. Um, so it was probably Home Despot. And these things were like 69 cents. Uh, of course, they were all, you know, most of them were all like bent and, you know, the bamboo was shattered. What are you guys doing? What's going on over here? Huh? Anything? Something? Woodland creatures? We being invaded? Are the Russians coming? It's not the Russians? Alright. Glad it's not the communists. Um, yeah. Oh, here we go, guys. Six o'clock. A little late there, Father Art. Oh, I'm sure you guys can hear that, man. The church bells. They are tolling, and they're tolling for me. Um, so I'll drink to that, man. Um, I'm gonna get these frog legs on here pretty quick. Um, you know, I just kinda wanted to hang out, man. I'm having a good time, just chilling with the dogs. Enjoying the relative peace and quiet that I've got here right now. Just looking at my, uh, you know, surveying my empire here. It's pretty cool. Uh, something I kind of left out of the last video. Uh, I'm sure I'm going to get asked about. Uh, probably, I've already been asked about. Um, I got an email or two about it. So, uh, I'm going to answer it now. Uh, the shirt that I'm wearing, the uh, enemy of my enemy is my enemy's enemy. You guys have probably heard me say that before. Um, that's one of my lesser used taglines um, And the shirt is from anonymous camping you guys may remember the anonymous camping guys uh, they sent me the um, biscuits and sausage gravy uh, Man we're dog camping here. Hold on See that's that's what I needed to do man. I needed to get what are you doing to your sister? What is this, man? Nobody wants to see that. Oh, man. All right. Yeah. Okay. Um. Anyway. Like I said, the anonymous camping guys, they're the ones who sent me the uh, biscuits and sausage gravy. Uh, they've been big supporters of my channel for a while. Um... You know, I kind of complained about the biscuits and sausage gravy, and um, they answered in kind, man. They sent me some grits. Um, I don't have them out here with me right now, um, you know, because this is outlaw camp. I'm camping in my backyard. They're in the house, but that's something I'm going to try and make tomorrow. Uh, if it does happen, I mean, you guys know how breakfast goes here at outlaw camp. Uh, you know, I always plan on it, but plan it's just a list of things that don't happen um anyway i've been talking to the anonymous camping guys and they were asking about my uh outlaw camper shirts which you know you guys have seen on me uh probably seen on the girlfriend um if you have not seen the shirt on uh, rooster run who is the uh you know shadiest of all shady benefactors Yeah, so see, man, the guy's down there in like a tropical 
your subtropical paradise representing outlaw camp um but the anonymous camping guys um you know my lesser used taglines they're like you know we like a man you should put them on shirts i don't know i'm like yeah you guys should make shirts uh so they did and uh they sent me this one which is pretty cool uh but the thing is um you know i hate to say it man because it's only the first of october but the holiday season is coming up um all i'm going to say about that is uh you may want to get some gifts for uh gifts gifts not gifts not like those you know cool cat dancing thing I mean, we should have an outlaw camper gift can you sell those i don't know but anyway um you may want to get some gifts g-i-f-t-s for uh you know your loved ones or your hated ones uh whoever and um the anonymous camping guys have uh pretty much given me a really big kick in the ass to get my own merch store going i am gonna do my best to do that before november 1st um as soon as i do get it up and running i will let you guys know i'll be selling some outlaw camper merchandise and also some anonymous camping merchandise so thanks anonymous camping guys here's to you and uh you know hopefully uh when i attempt to try those grits um it won't turn into a disaster like those biscuits and sausage gravy sorry right, guys uh like i said it's time to get the at least the teriyaki noodles going here uh i got a little bit too much uh flame over there to get the frog legs on but those will be next uh this stove uh you guys probably saw this in uh the last two adirondack uh camping videos um honestly i can't tell you who makes this thing oh well yes i guess i can because for some reason i saved the instructions i know why i saved the instructions because this stuff makes great tinder uh so it just says portable gas stove uh you know, tells me how to use the explosion hazard. Oh, you know, I never actually looked at these instructions, but these, you know, for instructions, which you don't, whoa, hold on. For instructions, which you don't normally get, they're actually pretty detailed. Um, this thing will run off of, uh, if you use the uh, adapter, a regular, uh, you know, one of those green propane tanks, which, for some reason i don't have laying around here i'm using it with the um isobutane stoves so that's cool so it's by uh these guys here i don't know what that says odoland odoland yeah i think it's odoland all right well whatever you can see it um i'll let you guys know you know what i paid for this or whatever i'll flash it down on the screen or put a link in the description or something uh, I've never used the uh, propane part um, just because those tanks are big and unwieldy. But I do have some. Uh, they may come out soon. I've been using these uh, isobutane tanks. I got like six of these for like 20 bucks. I think I've blown through like one of them. Uh, but this stove, man, this thing is great. Oh, man. Yeah, sorry. I got to... Uh, <laughs> it's my buddy El Chafe over there. Um I forgot I had a video of his going. So hold on. Um, so this, yeah, this stove, man, this thing is freaking great. Um, I've had no problems with it. Hopefully I won't have a problem with it tonight. Um, the uh, igniter actually still works. Um, you know, uh, I am <laughs> probably should not be setting it up on this milk crate. Uh, you know, I got something. Hold on. Yeah, man. Let's, uh, you know, let's throw it on a piece of wood. Nothing flammable about that, right? All right, yeah. Okay, that's a little bit better. Um, this cap, I should probably, I don't know, save for something. Uh, so I'm just going to screw this on. Hopefully it's turned off. We'll find out. 
Yeah, man. I really got to get those frog legs going. It's getting late, man. I'm burning daylight. Quarter after six. Okay, let's see. Uh, what do we got here? I'm going to turn this around like this. I don't really want the thing too close to the fire. Somewhere on the other is the igniter. Let's see what we got. Um, oh, look at that, guys. Oh, we're going to be having some teriyaki noodles in no time. Um, I did want to mention, I just heard from the girlfriend. Uh, she got, you know, from wherever she was, was that food truck thing, or I, man, fuck if I know. Uh, she got some barbecue ribs. So if this turns out to be a disaster, I got some barbecue ribs coming to me. Okay, guys, so it's uh, one and a half cups of water. Uh, I just realized I've never actually used this. I probably should have washed it out or something. Um, there we go. So that counts for washing it out. Um, okay, so one and a half cups of water. Uh, yeah, I got a measuring cup. There's one, this is a half cup, two, and three, it's one and a half cups. Shut that off. Um, I guess I'll just set this up here. And somewhere in here, uh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, see guys, I got the frog legs right here. Those are gonna be going on real quick. But I want to get this going. It's going to take a little, a minute or two to boil. Um, uh, you know, it says like a tablespoon of margarine or cooking oil or something. Fuck that shit, man. Use butter. I mean, margarine. Come on. Who uses margarine? You guys remember oleo? Yeah. Not olestra or olein. I mean, like oleo or, you know, just margarine. It's like plastic, I think. You know, so I guess if I really wanted that, I can't even get this unwrapped. It's like a one tablespoon of butter, like real butter, just wrapped in this ridiculous plastic container. Um, all right. There we go. There's the butter. We're going to drop it in the pot, and we're going to get this thing boiling. Uh, I don't know what the hell Sassy's doing over here. What are you doing, Grillis? You don't know? I don't know either. All right, um, I'm just going to set that on top of there uh, to start. Um, yeah, you know, I'm just going to throw this plastic right in that fire. Don't ever do that. I mean, I haven't said this in a while, guys. Don't do anything that I do. Seriously. All right, uh, we're going to get... Oh, look at this, man. It's already working on, on here. So that means that, you know, I probably could just cook it right on here, but that's for the frog legs. We're going to boil it up right over here. Um, let's just get going, guys. Pop that up there. Um, I got a lid. You guys have seen this. This is the uh, uh, G4 Free uh, mess kit, the pot from the mess kit I got. I showed you guys this in my uh, last video. Um, just go back and watch it. Whatever. We're gonna see how it goes. I'm gonna throw the lid on there so that boils. You toss it in. It's, uh, I was right. It's Nor. Nor sides these teriyaki noodles. I love that stuff, man. Uh, here's the frog legs. You'll see these in a minute. Oh, look at that. They're like dripping everywhere. Great. Frog juice. Um, I'm just gonna throw some wadobo spice on here. You guys all know I'm a huge fan of wadobo spice. What are you gonna do? Uh, here's another thing you should probably never do. Uh, I don't know what this is, uh, coconut oil. Um, I'm just gonna spray this grill and hopefully we won't die in a, uh, you know, fiery inferno. Nope, no fiery inferno. All right. Oh, well, there we go. A little bit of a fiery inferno. Uh, that's about to boil. Yeah, guys, um, you know, <laughs> Like Kevin from Small Plot said, this is not a cooking channel. Okay, so these frog legs, man, here we go. Uh, there's one, um, there's two. Yeah, these are gonna take a while, I think. Three, uh, four, four frog legs, all right. 
And uh, this, okay, over here. With these, yeah. You know what else? I don't have a fucking, uh, I ain't got a utensil. All right, so we throw those in there. Uh, turn it down. Down, 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 down. Yeah, there we go. See, you can simmer with one of those. Um, the uh, little utensil pouch here. Uh, somewhere in here, in here is a spoon, fork, knife. Yeah, the last one I grab, obviously. Okay. Yeah, not like fucking cooking with Jack, huh? Okay. Um, I thought there was like a little thing that slides up. Oh, there we go. Okay. We're just gonna kind of stir this up here. Yeah, there we go. All right. Your business. Yeah, uh, I don't know how long this is supposed to cook for. We're gonna find out. Um, I ain't got my glasses on. Uh, two minutes? No, stand for two minutes. Seven minutes? Reduce heat and simmer seven minutes. All right, well, if that's not a simmer. Oh, we can turn it up a little bit. All right, there we go, there's a simmer. This uh, probably should not be burned. I'm just gonna dump this frog juice into there. Um, little adobo spice on the old frog legs. Uh, I probably should have done this before, but you know, what are you gonna do? If all you got is what you got, that's all you got. Okay. I mean, I'm sure you can use Wadobo on frog, can't you? I don't fucking know. It's insane. Oh shit, man, this is boiling like a. I don't even know what. Okay. Shit. Yeah, look at that, guys. See? She's boiling right up there. This is gonna be delicious, I'll tell you. Okay, so frog legs, simmering uh, teriyaki noodles. Like I said, man, if this is all a disaster, um, you know, I mean, if this is all a disaster, um, the girlfriend is either on her way with ribs or she got ribs, she'll be here at some point. I don't know. Um, those are gonna take forever to cook, um, but I'm gonna let them sit there for a minute, get warmed up, then I'll figure something out. Um, I got a beer somewhere. Here we go. At least I think there's still some beer in there. Mmm. Mm hmm. It's not even piss warm and flat. Did you know what I say about that? There's Gorilla Spillis. That's Gorilla Gorilla. No, just. She thinks she's getting something. You're going to get some frog leg. There's Tater. Lacey. Laces. Potato. Um. I have pocket treats. You always want a pocket treat? All right. Pocket treat for you. Pocket treat for you. There you go.